Shalom, call Haloyim La Yahawa, Bahasham, Yahawa Shai, Bahasham, Racha Kudash. Double honors unto our apostles and others, a great millstone that rule well. Much peace and blessings to all you sense of Akim out there that's pushing this 100% truth. With all sincerity, faith, and with charity, this is your brother Ash from the Great Millstone Miami camp coming back with another lesson through the spirit and power of Yahweh Bahasham Yahweh Shai. Hello, well, and satisfying. In this lesson, I want to speak on the times that we're in concerning the major enchantments that's been going out left and right. Okay, as we know, this is the the rulership. We're living in the time period of the rulership of the biblical nation of Esau, Edom. Okay, the twin brother of mm -hmm. Jacob. The twin brother of Jacob. The father of the Israelites. And just how the most I created his people Israel to be the, the people of the Lord, he has that, that left hand counterpart. Like it tells you in the book of Sirach, I believe, 33, Ecclesiasticus, also known as Sirach, chapter 33. It tells you all things were created for for uh, good or evil, roughly paraphrasing. The, as, as the, uh, as, uh, you know, uh, righteousness and wickedness is going hand in Go goes uh goes up head and head, okay, head to head, and that's what we're living in. We're living in the rulership of the time period that the the wicked nation, the nation that the Most High has in the nation against forever, the people that are the only neighbor of the Israelites not promised mercy, the only nation not promised mercy from the Heavenly Father Yahweh through His Son Yahweh Shai. They're ruling right now. That's the time we're in, and. We're in the time period of the end of their rulership. So this man came in with all type of bloodshed, all type of enchantments, all type of witchcraft and and uh, sorcery. That's how he got this. It looked, how was America established? How was any place that Esau Edom has got his hand on? I'm talking about the so-called white man. All the lands they, they, they conquered. America, Europe, Okay, because they they not the original inhabitants of Europe. Okay, Europe belonged to the Japhetic nations. How did they get Australia? How they got South Africa? How they got uh, Russia, which was also uh, Japhetic nations uh, land. Okay, because the most side, the Heavenly Father gave Esau land, which was uh, Mount Seir, Petra. Right? But... They got every place they live and dwell now by the edge of the sword. Rape, rob, and murder. The thief coming out but to steal, kill, and destroy. And that's exactly what they've done. Okay? So how much more in the end, in the end of their rulership, when they're actually being taken out of power, they're going to come with that sword mightily, like it says in Revelation the 12th chapter. Woe to the inhabitants of the earth and the sea, for the devil come unto you having great wrath, because he know that he have a but, sh uh, but sh a short time. Roughly paraphrasing. He's gonna come with. He's gonna come with it, and that's very soon to come. But as of right now, this, this, this devil was using his witchcraft because the part of his blessing that his father Isaac gave him was the sword, right? But also that sword, you know, representing his weaponry, his uh, technology. That's how he got uh, the so-called Native Americans to submit, because the, those so-called Native Americans, the just uh, American indigenous peoples, also with the uh, Tainos and the Arawaks in the Caribbean, that dwelled in the island of uh, Hispaniola where uh, Christopher Columbus first came, they was kicking Esau ass, man. But it's only because Esau had that that, that gun, and now today what he has drones, missiles. All right, fighter jets. And with that, that's one part of how, the, how he conquered these nations. But he also ha uses his policy, his witchcraft, his paperwork. And he, this devil actually pro practice pure up Satanism, starting with his elites. They take counsel from the spiritual demons, Satan, and their left-hand spirits. And they and they listen to them. They do what they, what they tell them to do. And they, they get blessings out of it. And they know that's what they do. Okay? They create different uh, distractions. Everything you see in the news is fake and set up to, to try to do what? It's all about control, man. And 
As for our people, the people of the Lord, you so-called blessed Latinos, Native Americans, you Israelites, according to the scriptures, a lot of you is just with the shits. You just going with the shits. You you, you totally juiced in the Esau system. Y'all believe in everything he's putting out. Okay, you sit in the car by yourself with the mask on, and you 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 just you just lost. Why? Because you you you're under a spell. You're under that spell that 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 Esau has put over you. And we're in a, a heavy time for that right now. So I'm just going to get a couple of scriptures to show you that the elect of Israel, the, the, the chosen, they ain't going to be taken with those enchantments. Because he's pushing out heavy enchantments. Believe you me. Oh, that's oh, matter of fact, I got to start with that. Right. This is Matthew chapter 24 and 24. <laughs> For there shall arise false Hamashiachs and false prophets, and shall show great signs and wonders, and so much that if it were possible, they shall deceive the very elect. So you're going to have people rise up in this world right before the coming of the of the Messiah. You're going to have people raise up in the world, people that a lot of people look up to and follow and, and worship and listen to take heed of whatever they say on the news, okay? And and why is that? Because that person is has a spirit behind them, got a, got a certain energy behind them. Which is the, the 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 energy of the of the left hand, the spiritual demon Satan, and and the Most High has given power to them through Satan, because Satan works for the Heavenly Father Yahweh through His Son Yahweh Shai, because Yahweh Shai has been given all authority to work these miracles, these different enchantments and and, and this witchcraft, so that the people could believe on them, because they're they're they were created to be destroyed. That's why it says, in so much that if it were possible, they would they shall deceive the very elect. The very elect are the very chosen. So this witchcraft is gonna be so strong that if the heavenly father didn't have a spirit, a certain spirit on the elect to keep them from those uh uh enchantments, which are the signs and the wonders, his technology, the things he's coming out with, these these people woo, they woo, they wanna get in, they wanna get tapped into the metaverse. They, they want to trust the science and all that bullshit. They said if, if it was possible, they would deceive the very elect. So that's how strong it is, man. Certainly it's, it's either you're of the elect or, or these things going to take you. They're going to they gonna take you away. As a matter of fact, I'll close out with this. This is going to be a quick lesson. I don't have much battery. I'm going to uh, go to Ephesians 2 and verse 1. And you have he quickened who are dead and trespasses and sins. Quickened means to be made alive. Who was made alive? The elect of the nation of Israel through the washing of the word. As Yahweh Shai said, is my words and a spirit, they are life. It is the spirit that quickeneth. The flesh profiteth nothing. The words that I speak unto you, they are spirit and they are life. The most high quicken is elect with the word. We've been made alive, been reactivated, renewed, refreshed from this dead state like the rest of the people, uh, inhabitants of the earth. They are dead. He that wandered out of a way of understanding shall remain in the congregation of the dead. All right. Ephesians 2 and 2. Where in times past ye walk according to the course of this world, meaning everybody. We was walking, going in the same direction as everybody else on this planet. According to the prince of the power of the air. Who is the prince of the power of the air? That's talking about the spiritual demon Satan. Trickling down to his, his uh, physical counterpart. His physical manifestation. Which is the so-called white man Esau Edom. That's his the, the, uh, worldwide. Wherever those people are. Whether they're Swedish, uh, Finnish finished they just put out a script uh law saying they're gonna ban uh the bible as hate speech 
whether they eat the Italian devils, which you got a lot of Italians are Israelites, but you got a lot of them like uh, you know, uh Crystal Crystal Ball Cologne, aka Christopher Columbus. You got Spanish Edomites, you got French Edomites, you got South Af African Edomites and, and Russian and Australian Edomites. But they all Edomites, man. And they, they F this world up big time. Okay, the spirit that now worketh in the children of disobedience. And and if you're not in this truth, you're a child of disobedience, which means you're a rebel. You rebelling against the Heavenly Father. And who taught you to do that, Esau? Which our people are, you know, two thirds of our people, they're already rebellious against the Lord. But Esau, they, 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 uh, you know, as the scriptures say, the righteous is more excellent than his neighbor, but the way of the wicked seduceth him. So our people, they, they have been turned out by this man. The people of the Heavenly Father, Yahweh, through his son, Yahweh Shai, the Israelites have been turned out by the, the people of the spiritual demon Satan. As Yahweh Shai said, ye are of your father the devil, and as and the lust of him shall ye do. He was a, a liar from the beginning. He's the father of lies. Okay? That, that's why you don't believe me. Because uh, I'm the truth, or if we paraphrase it. Okay? Verse 3, it says, Among whom also we all had our conversation. Meaning, meaning our our ways, our uh, our uh, what's the word, conduct, okay, and times past in the lust of our flesh, fulfilling the desires of the flesh and of the mind, and were by nature the children of wrath, even as others. So it's this it's physical nature, it's human nature, to 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 be a devil worshiper. <laughs> That's what the scriptures say, okay. But the Most High, who is rich in his mercy for his great love, wherewith he loved us, even when we were dead in sins, have quickened us together by Hamashiach. By grace are ye saved, and have raised us up together and made us sit in heavenly places in Hamashiach Yahweh Shai. Okay, so we 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 up higher. We 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 sitting up on a higher level than the rest of these earthly people. Okay, and with that being said, we still have to remain temperate, we still have to remain vigilant and circumspect. Okay, why? And I end off with this low one in the uh, uh, first Peter, so like, yeah, first Peter chapter 5 and 8. Be sober, be vigilant, because your adversary, the devil, as a roaring lion, walketh about seeking whom he may devour. You see, so the spiritual demon Satan is out here, he's also working mightily through his people, the Edomites, as well as the wicked of our people. Don't get it twisted, okay. Looking for who he may devour because he can't get everybody. So he's at least going hard on the people that he can get. They're already gone. But the ones he can't get, he, he's fucking with them heavy, trying to get them. So that's why we have to remain vigilant. And, and at the end of the day, we don't know if we're of the elect or not. That's why it says, uh, you know, if you do these things, you shall never fall. Okay? Give diligence to make thy calling and election sure. So with that, I want to give all praise, honor, and glory unto Yahweh Bashem, Yahweh Shai Bashem, Rahakwadash. Until the next one, inshallah.